This video goes along with a blog post in which I discuss how to enable a robot to determine how far it is from something by using an LED. This is a small robot and it has a web interface and the robot's equipped with headlights so as it approaches an object, if it shines its lights, that the number of pixels that are brighter on that object uh, will be greater the closer it gets. So farther away its uh, headlights will be attenuated and it will affect a small portion of the object. And as it gets closer, it will be uh, brighter and, and um, or less attenuated and affect more of the object. So I'll uh, move the robot closer and uh, shine the headlights and you'll see uh, what I mean. I'm going to do a little demo of the distance finding capabilities uh, of this little robot using uh, an LED. And uh, so go ahead and move it forward a little bit. Oops. And we'll get a distance here. I think it's the distance 58. The actual distance is... ...61. So not too bad. Move forward a little bit. I uh, dropped it earlier, and now the alignment's off, so it's, it's really hard to steer. I uh, think the distance is 44, the actual distance is. Thirty-nine. And we'll do one more. A little bit closer. Alrighty. Okay, I think the distance is 22 there, and the actual distance is... 18. So, other than the fact that one of the wheels appears to be damaged and it's a little hard to steer, the actual distance finding is, is not so bad. The um, reason why it's doing this could not get a distance is the, there has to be a specific um, uh, timing between when the lights go on and when the measurements made, uh, that timing is is critical because there's uh, an automatic light level adjustment that the uh, iPhone camera does that throws everything off. Um, I have more specifics about that in my blog, but uh, this was sort of a, a demo to go along with the discussion on the blog. So if you're interested in uh, getting some code and seeing a bit more about this, please visit the uh, blog. There'll be a, a link in the video description.